Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So tonight's video I got a little bit different motor for you. And um, I've been experimenting today with the Zero Force motors. And um, this was actually one of Redesign's idea. Uh, we have the coil right here. So this has the coil right here in the center. Um, or the steel I should say. And the coil is this way. And then the magnet orientation is the same as the coil. So they're going this way. So if you look at the poles, this is north, south and then south north so it wants to line up right here so if you do um, get your timing right you know you should be coming turning on here turning off right before dead center and um, you can make a really neat little motor because these are super strong these are um, n42 neo magnets one inch by one inch so if this steel was facing up you'd, you'd never be able to turn this like this so it's um almost zero cogging which is really cool for a magnet motor and um, I have the optics up here so here's the optical timing so you just have one notch here and one notch there and um, then I just have my my typical uh, MOSFET circuit and then the output of the motor goes into my cap dumps and then charging this battery and then we're just running on 12 volts and um, yeah so every time this gets to the zero point right here it turns off and makes a high voltage like three four hundred volt spike and the circuit collects it through the diodes and then it comes through into the cap dump which charges up to 16 volts and then discharges into this battery so pretty neat so let's um let's fire this up so this thing is um, pretty neat it, it can run at pretty low speed and then here's our scope so we have the pulse width modulator going right now so all you could see is spikes on there. So this is the output on the bottom that's charging the cap dump. So so just like this, we're running about 100 milliamps. So let's turn this thing up to about half an amp. So here's half an amp. The motor runs really smooth. And, uh, here's the scope shot. So you can see it's starting to get a little wave from the magnet in there. And um, at half an amp, we're doing uh, 440 RPMs. And then here's our output dumping into this battery. And there's a lot of glare on this. So the battery's pretty much full. I like to bring it up to 15 volts. So yeah, at half an amp, we're... we're about three amps every second and a half and then let's bring up the one amp so here's one amp see the pulses are getting tighter together so 637 almost 640 so it's a really efficient little motor I mean we're talking about one little coil there so if you had if you had them all the way around you know if you had four or six of them this could be a pretty powerful motor. Um, Redesign had this set up on his, on his Zero Force. And um, he had the same thing. He has five coils all the way around it with five magnets. And uh, seemed to work really well. So I tried it myself and I definitely agree. It, it runs nice. It's just um, very critical to have the timing right. And it's neat because you got the, this is actually a transformer core that I cut in half and made a coil out of so this actually has the um, silicone steel in it so it makes a real nice pulse and um, so let's just bring this thing up to full power so we're doing just just a hair over two amps and then here's our output pulsing once a second three amps and um, here's our full waveform so no more pulse width see the bottom going down with the cap with the cap down so as it's charging discharging and uh, at two amps we're uh, 9 14 so almost a thousand rpms at at two amps so that's 24 watts with just a, a single coil motor so I'd say that's pretty good it runs nice and smooth this is um, if you had actually a bearing on this side it'd be even smoother but you can see I could I could hold this down to where the the shaft is actually 
bending and it's got a lot of torque that's three amps right there so it's pretty strong just one coil so anyway guys if you have any questions leave them in the comment and uh, don't forget to check out my store thanks for watching